Let's imagine this. What do you want your life to be like after you retire? Are you enjoying your post work life, travel, hobbies, friends, or loneliness, illness, and loneliness? Globally, life expectancy is increasing every year. Although some aspects of mental well being can improve with age, the risk of health deterioration increases. Furthermore, one in six elderly people are categorized as living alone in Japan today, making it more difficult to monitor their health status. But don't worry, I have been working with several welfare facilities for the elderly. Through this experience, I realized that there is a big gap between the welfare staff and the research side. Therefore, I decided to devote myself to this field, thinking that I should be the one to open up a new academic path that integrates welfare and information science. To achieve this integration, I am making a communication robot and monitoring system that will estimate elders' health while they communicate with the robot. In the field of elderly welfare, quality of life is a useful index that comprehensively reflects not only an individual physical well-being, but also their mental and social well-being. Although a user's quality of life can be evaluated through their conventional measurement method with a questionnaire, doing so is problematic in that it requires effort from the elder. Therefore, I constructed a system in which a communication bot scores a user's quality of life state by extracting features from all the information obtained during the conversation, such as visual, sound, and speech information. This has already reached the level of practical application. However, while the number of adoptions has been increasing, there are still some elder welfare facilities that have not been able to successfully establish a sustainable relationship with a robot. This is because the human-robot interaction lacks development over time and humans are entering the burnout phase. As a solution, I am improving the technology to create a continuous, more natural relationship between elders and robots by letting the robot generate personalized behaviors for each elder based on their estimated quality of life. This personalization of a robot's response is a goal of the field of human-robot interaction. We believe that the construction of a human-machine interface based on much dimensional quality of life estimation can realize a long-term relationship and also can be a solution to various problems that have lingered in the development of ICT in elderly welfare. I promise that I will make full use of intelligence robots to help you have a better life after retirement. Thank you. Mm -hmm.